Alrighty then, chat room. I have returned. And I have a sandwich. What the fuck? Time to experiment with this fucking thing. I do not appear to be able to beat this fight. Well... Okay. So, strategizing. Are there encounters in this room? No, but there are encounters in this room. Let's go in with limit. Roar! Hello, everybody! Roar! Aerith first? Not Aerith first. Do nine hundred. Cross slash. I fuck. I accidentally turned on. Uh, I I accidentally kept that on. Whatever. It's not gonna do much because Seal Evil didn't make him stop fucking hitting me.
Only 60, huh? Yeah, no, it's... Resistant to fire. 10,000 HP, huh? Wow, that doesn't do enough either. Holy hell. And god damn it. She died. Yeah, there's dead ass nothing I can do. Dead ass nothing I can do. The game literally like makes me have to double my recommended level between between fights. That's really stupid. So, evil, whatever the fuck, move, feel evil. Whatever it is. No, I haven't tried grinding yet for this. What I did just there was not for that. I am going to have to grind it, which is really dumb, because if I was, if I was prepared for the previous boss, the very next one shouldn't be, like, outright curb stomping me five minutes later. I can imagine if it was, like, a dungeon later, but not one fight later. That's, that's a bit much. Feel evil, yeah.
We're doing what we can to level up quickly. Odin just is basically free level ups off of everybody. I'm going to turn off the MP thing. The 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 the, the maximum everything. Because there's a guy right outside that can heal me. It's not necessary. Yeah, I can just do that. So there's no need to tease it that hard. Being able to, like, regular attack with Aerith is faster, so...
I don't know what level I need to be at for this boss. But the boss is level 45. So... Given how I handled lost number, I should be at least 35 before I fuck with this thing. And Cloud is, but like, the rest of my current party isn't. Odin is very effective. Actually, I'm realizing I probably made a mistake here. Oh, no, they don't heal off of that. Okay, good. Let me, get, let me get Cloud to 40, and then we'll see if that does what I need it to do. I gotta level up off that. So we rest, we save... And we try again. I grinded like five levels. I've got more dice now. I turned the thing off. I don't know why it still gave me another limit break. Unless I'm just getting them. I just, I just got it like that. I'm turning off the hyperspeed.
Now it's dealing double the damage of the dice roll. And it's rolling three dice. So it's definitely, definitely a lot better now. I know I'm hitting limit break because I'm taking so much fucking damage. There, I did both cure all and healing win, so that way fucking I uh, had the opportunity to heal twice. All right, and we're good. Every level gained in this game is actually crazy. Crazy powerful each level. If I didn't choose to bring Kate Sith with me, what would have happened? Because I chose to bring him with me. The only character I was forced to bring with me was Eric. Would the game have made me go back to the Golden Saucer and get him? Yeah, it's definitely the less dice rolls, because it leveled up to the point where, like, it rolls three dice now, instead of two. And that itself would be enough, but now it does double the number of damage, and not just the number of damage. So, like, a two is now 400, not 200. On three dice. That's quite the leap. What if I use Meteor? Now that would be very counterproductive, wouldn't it?
Oh, I don't like that. Separath. I see that you are awake again. Am I already in disc 2? Did the game just like provide no indicator of when that switches because it's the Switch version? <laughs> wow, that was fast! How the fuck did you already get here? I'm Kate number 2! Let's be real, he probably already had that thing loaded up and going before he even told you he made that decision. Probably it's had it on its way the second he figured out what he had to do. Another fever dream, courtesy of Square. He is, like, literally unable. Tifa has to know what's going on because of the whole fucking Nibelheim thing.
Where's the rest of my fucking party? Where am I, for that matter? Oh, it's Gongaga Village again. Why here? Ooh, mystify. I don't know what that does, but I didn't. Know, I don't have it, so I'm grabbing it. Do I have my party on me with me right now? Because like everybody's on the list here, so I don't know if that's. Mm. What the fuck? What's this place? Weapons. I'll buy some fucking weapons. Shouldn't have done that. Those weapons are not good. Well, this one's good for materia slots. But, like, Runeblade also has four, so... I shouldn't have did that. I'll at least ditch this. I haven't given Tifa anything new in a while. He's literally already wearing this. Yeah, I shouldn't have bothered. Alright. So, all the weapons. All of them. Maybe not this one. This one is better. Or is it? It has no materia and no growth. It's just big attack. I'm wondering if that's worth it. I'm gonna look up to see if this item does anything wacky that I don't know about. No, I found it in the temple. Uh, no, according to the uh, wiki, it is a joke weapon. The fact that it has no growth and no slots is what makes it a joke, even though it buffs the shit out of her attack to more than double. Right. All right, time to start giving materials to people. What does Mystify do? For, uh, confusion. Let's do Fire All and then Bahamut and sense and destruct and rama rama mama uh 
Um. Rocket punch. So this this weapon is exactly the same way. It's just a significant fucking attack buff. Over the best thing that I have otherwise. But no growth and no materia. I should give... Okay, wait. I know what the fuck to do. Now that I'm looking up how this shit works. Materia, bear it. Destruct, added effect. Perfect. Because apparently that has a 1 in 5 chance to just instant death an, uh, an enemy. Which is fantastic. Literally could not get a better benefit out of anything. Ever. Okay, so... If she went to the City of the Ancients, where the fuck does that mean I have to go? Surely not the temple, right? Harp? Game didn't tell me that. Well, okay, so executive decision time then. It is 11 of God's own PM hours o'clock right now. And whatever I gotta do next is probably going to be long. We just got done with something, so I think now is the best time to call it. So, this is going to be where we stop for today. So, given that we are going to stop here for today, um, I would like to remind the people that we're going to be streaming again on Saturday. We're either going to come up with something to stream in collaboration with somebody, or we are going to play Yakuza Kiwami. If we cannot do that. Um, but we will be streaming, regardless. Um, and then going back to, uh, next week, it is gonna be, again, Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday. Because we are now done with Yakuza 0, we are playing Yakuza Kiwami now. If we don't play it on Saturday, we'll be starting it on Wednesday. Thursday will be more of this. And that's gonna be the schedule for the, uh, foreseeable near future. So, thanks everybody for stopping by. Very much appreciated. Thank you for continuing to stop by. And it is a incredibly, incredibly likely scenario that we made affiliate on this stream. Um, tomorrow is when I will know for sure. If we didn't, then we'll get it next time. We're, we're really, really close. So thanks, everybody. And everybody have a great night.